filleting a whole fish can save you a lot of money and it's not too hard to do. All you need to know is the technique. Whenever you're buying whole fish at the supermarket or if you have a local fishmonger that you like, you want to look for a few things. One, of course, is smell. The fish should not smell at all. It should smell almost like seawater. The second thing you want to look for is that the eyes aren't all bloodshot. You want them to be clear and not cloudy at all. And the third thing is the gills. The gills should be, just as they are here, pink but not bloody. This is how you know that your fish is fresh. As you can see here, this fish has been gutted, which means that the innards have been removed. It has also been trimmed slightly. So there was a little pectoral fin here that has been removed and also the back fin has been removed as well. Now, if you wanted to cook a whole fish like this, the one thing that you would need to make sure you do first, get all of the scales off. You could take the blade of a knife and actually go against the fish scraping up any of those scales. But I'm gonna remove the skin today, so I'm gonna show you how to do that. So to start filleting a fish, you need a sharp, sharp knife. I'm using a boning knife here because a boning knife is a thin knife that's flexible. Take your knife and you're gonna go right behind that pectoral fin. I have my knife slightly angled. You're gonna slice into the fish behind the head and you're gonna feel resistance. You're gonna feel bones in the fish that's when you want to stop slicing. So now what you're going to do is you're going to start the knife right at the tip of the backbone here, right behind the head, gently glide the knife, cutting through the skin along this top backbone here. Once you get a few inches down, you can actually pick up the fillet of the fish and rotate it up so that you can see what you're doing. And instead of cutting like this, you're gonna glide the knife gently along the backbone and you wanna make sure that you stay along the backbone because you don't wanna take away too much of the flesh of the fish. So stay close to that backbone, gliding the knife, pulling back the fillet as you do it. As you can see, I'm coming past the backbone here and now this is kind of the stomach of the fish here. Keep on gliding the knife. Now a sharp knife is key here because if you have a dull knife, it's not gonna cut through the fish. It's going to just flake the fish apart. So now you have a beautiful filet. If you liked the crispy skin of the fish, you can keep it on, but I'm gonna remove it a little bit later. I'm gonna repeat the process with the other side. So you're gonna flip the fish, cut right behind the head and that pectoral fin and glide your knife along the backbone. Now, whether your fish is a small fish or a big fish, it's all the same for any round fish. This is a snapper and this is considered a round fish. There is another type of fish called a flat fish, which would be sole or flounder. And there is a totally different way of filleting that fish. So you have to stay tuned for that episode. You can save this for a wonderful fish stock if you'd like. Take the filet, put it skin side down. You're gonna take your sharp knife and Right before the tip of the filet here, you're gonna cut into the meat, angle your knife slightly, and you're going to hold onto this little tail that you've created. This might be a little slippery, so if you want, you can use a piece of paper towel to give you a better grip on the skin of the filet. Push down, and you're going to shimmy the skin from left to right and pull the skin back towards me and push the knife away from me. And what this does is it glides the knife along the back of the skin and it separates the filet from the skin. And it should come off in one nice piece here. You should have no skin on the underside of your filet and now you're ready to cook this up however you'd like. So there you go, you're ready to cook your fish up. How easy was that? I really encourage you guys to go out buy a whole fish, take it home and fillet it. Give yourself some practice and I know you will become a pro.